I think council taxpayers in Bournemouth will find this astonishing. At the end of the day, they're the people who are fronting up for these flights. And okay, it's not a huge amount of money in the grand scheme of things, but people are being expected. It's, tax, it's taxpayers' money. We're, we're in a cost of living crisis. And, uh, you know, uh, earlier uh, this year, I know a councillor in Reading spent uh, £2,100 on expenses for a flight to Pennsylvania. I mean, when people, a, a councillor, a district councillor, a county councillor, they're paid a little bit of money. They should, most of them are reasonable people who want to make their local area better. But why do they have to take flights in the first place? I don't understand that either. Absolutely, and unfortunately for the residents of Bournemouth, there's no reason given. Now, it's good to see the council are going to look into this and, and try and find out where these flights went and who was on them, and that's, I think, probably the least they should be doing. But it's kind of a problem of respect for taxpayers' money. And actually, you know, I don't know if you know, we release every year our town hall rich list, which shows all the council employees in the country who received over £100,000 in a given year. And in Bournemouth, there were 14 of them, 